And we're back with the Daily News with Dr. Debbie Lines with our Mind Your Health segment for February. Which is wonderful. <laughs> Thank you for having me. It's Heart Month. Yes, it is. And you know, one of the things that I think people don't recognize about Heart Health Month and Go Go Heart Health yes. is one of the um, best ways to have a healthy and strong heart is to manage your stress yes. and anxiety. Have good, have a good mindset. Well, I was thinking, of course, no, you know, you need to exercise, no smoking. You need to eat right. Good but sleep. The, good sleep, mm -hmm. yes. But it's, there's a lot up here, the stress that can trigger things that then mm -hmm. affect that heart. So talk about that. Well, it's really interesting because I think we don't think about it, um, keeping our heart healthy and managing our mental health kind of all rolled into right. one. But our brain controls pretty much everything about our bodies. And when we feel anxiety or we feel a lot of stress, what happens? We get clammy, our heart rate goes That's up, up. <laughs> boom, 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 right? Mm -hmm. um, interesting kind of Fun fact, one of the easiest ways to lose weight is to manage your stress and anxiety, and your weight will go down because of the way the hormones are metabolized. It's really, you said you were actually right. talking about that in one yeah, of your headlines. Yes, exactly. It's just amazing the connection with the mind and the, and the body, and you talk about it every month. We really do. One of the things I wanted to mention, Robin, that this month in particular is something that I think we can do as a tool to manage your mental health. And that is, I'm a big journal person. You are? Well, yes. Now, I brought a journal journal. Is okay? this like have empty pages? Oh, no. Oh. Some of it has empty pages. It guides journals, you. Yes. It's a, this is a guided journal. Big life journal. Exactly. It's fabulous. And really what it talks about that's interesting for adults is it talks about two mindsets. And I already know the answer for you. <laughs> Do you have a fixed mindset, which you're pretty rigid, you like your plan, you work your plan, and that's sort of the way life goes? Or do you have a growth mindset? And that is that you're open to new experiences, open to uh, learning new things. things. I already know what you are. You are a growth <laughs> mindset. Definitely. Reinventing. And what's interesting about people that are fixed mindset is that it's, it's sort of the old adage, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. Not true. It has nothing to do with age. Right. I just love learning, and mm -hmm. I love, that's why I love working here, because sure. I get to meet fantastic, interesting people, mm -hmm. and just keep that mind open, keep it active. Exactly. And that, but then that also reduces my stress, because yes. I'm involved and active. Yes. And then I try to exercise. I don't yeah. know if I eat as right as I should, but... But you know, <laughs> the heart is, you know, I think about this off, maybe not often, but the heart is just co it's constantly mm -hmm. pumping. Correct. Constantly for your entire life. Well, and you, well, you know, when we're talking about, I didn't mean to yeah, interrupt you, no. but when we're talking about your heart as a muscle, yes, you got to exercise it. Right. And we're talking about your brain, which controls a lot of your muscles, right. including your heart. Right. You've got to exercise it. And having a growth mindset and documenting um, your day at a glance is really interesting. A lot of the younger kids do it on their phones with notes. And it doesn't have to be this um, creative piece that you <laughs> right. write. It's more, what were your experiences? What were your feelings? What brought you joy? Moments of gratitude. We talk about all of that. And I think February is a great month to talk about all of that. And it's also the month of love. Yes, love it you. is. I know. We, we have fun together. <laughs> I, I learn so much every time we're together. Thank so you, I appreciate Debbie. being yes. invited to talk about yeah. health. Good. Good job. Big life journal. Very interesting. Do you journal? I do. You do? Mm -hmm. Do you? Uh, no. Not to, well, but I should. Well, you kind of do. You keep Yeah, those. well, I sort of, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Debbie Lines, again, great update, great information, as always, Debbie. And we'll be right back with more daily news. Don't go away.